Make t the subject of the formula 6 brackets t minus p is equal to 3t minus 2. Now the problem here is that t, the subject, appears twice in the original expression. So we've got 6 brackets t minus p is equal to 3t minus 2. First step would be to expand the brackets, so that's going to give me 6t minus 6p. And this side will just keep the same. Notice I keep my equal signs in a column. Right, now we either look at 6t and 3t, and, and we see which is the smallest, which is 3t, and we do the opposite. So we're going to get 3t, uh, 6t minus 3t gives me 3t, minus 6p is equal to minus 2. Now we're going to add 6p to both sides, so we're going to get 3t on this side, and then 6p minus 2 on this side, or you could write it as minus 2 plus 6p if you wanted to. And then the final step, obviously because we make t the subject, is to divide by 3. So dividing both sides by 3, we get t on this side, which is equal to 6p minus 2 over 3. So we've got t being the subject of the formula. So this has been a video to show you how to uh, make change the subject of formula when the subject ap appears twice in the original formula. I hope you've understood and I thank you very much for watching.